So, as you remember from my community tab, I told you guys I got one of these As I Am dolls. So, this is the doll I got. Um, she's really cute. Um, her clothing is pretty nice. She comes with a checkered shirt that opens in the front. And it has three little buttons on the side. So, it's a pink and white checkered shirt with three red buttons. And she has a little shirt underneath that says, I am green with a leaf. And that is in green lettering with a green leaf. And it's a white shirt. And it does have sleeves. And it does have sleeves. It's not a sleeveless shirt. And then she also comes with these brown shorts that have a little belt on them. And some pockets on the side. They don't open, but that's okay. I don't think the clothes were the gimmick with this doll. And she also comes with some socks and some brown, sh some uh, white socks and some brown shoes with some yellow laces on them. And her hair is in some cute little braids and her hair is brown with some white highlights. She has kind of a, kind of like a medium skin tone and she has kind of these like purplish brown eyes. Hard to tell. I think they're like a purplishly brown. I think they're meant to be brown, but they look kind of purple. <laughs> and she has some purple makeup on. And she also has some pink lips. She's very cute. And now, I am going to take her outfit off. So that I can show you all the points of articulation that this doll has. Because when I was playing around with her, I discovered that she has so much articulation. It's incredible. So let's take her outfit off and check that out. Okay. There we go. All right, so let's start with her feet. Her feet are articulated, so she has ankle joints. And she also has knee joints that are double jointed knees. So she has double jointed knees. And now I'm going to take the rest of her outfit off so we can check out the rest of her articulation. Just gonna quickly do this. Let's see, here we go. Go. Cause I don't think anybody that did the review for these actually took their outfit off. So that's what I'm doing. I got her outfit off, so now we can see that her arms are articulated at the shoulder and at the elbow, so it bends at the elbow and at the wrist, so you can see it bends at the elbow, the shoulder, elbow, wrist, your typical um, articulation there. She does have a bust joint so that she can move up here at the bust around the ribs area and then she has this joint here so that she can sit up straight and then she has joints at her hip so she can move her legs at the hip socket and then she also has where she can turn her legs to the sides so on each leg she can do that as well and she can turn her head so lots of articulation let's count the joints one two three four five six seven 
8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 joints. That is probably the most I've seen on any doll. So that is a lot of joints. She has 18 points of articulation, which is the most I've seen on any doll. Um, as far as a Playline doll goes, she has the most I've ever seen. And that is pretty impressive. So, yeah. Um, so on my final note, I really think that these are pretty good um, for the As I Am dolls. Um, let's check her rooting. I don't think that's really it's not too bad. It does cover. I don't know how thickly rooted it is because it is in a style. So it's kind of hard to tell. I don't really want to take it out of the braids because it looks pretty like that. But let's see. Let's see the rooting here. I mean, it doesn't feel super thick, but it, it does cover. So I don't think her rooting is super thick, but it does cover. Her screening doesn't seem to have any real terrible flaws of it. Um, it just seems like it's printed like it's not too badly printed. Um, she doesn't have holes in her ears for earrings. And that is about it for this doll. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys next time. Make sure to like and subscribe. And as far as I know, um, these are the most articulated dolls I've encountered. So that's pretty interesting. So I don't think anybody else undressed the doll to actually count the articulated points and everything. So yeah, I just wanted to check that out. And as you can see, the head, the back of the head is marked as I am in China. And so is the body. So that is something interesting to note. I'm not sure if any other doll heads fit on this body. Um, I'm not an expert on that kind of thing. But um, she is really cute. I'm probably just going to keep her as is. But she is really cute. Um, for $11 I paid. I don't think I got a bad deal. I think this is pretty nice. Um, the regular like $30. Which is a little steep for a... For just a basic fashion doll, but uh, with all the articulated points, you can do a lot of interesting photo shoots and things like that with this doll. So let me quickly get her. You know, I'm just gonna end the video. I'll just zoom up in her face a little bit. She's really cute. But yeah, I'm gonna end the video here. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys next time. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I am going to get her dressed again because she's feeling kind of cold. But I will see you guys next time. Bye now.